the city of Maumel is promoting a tool that residents can use to quickly address quality of life issues. Channel 7's Ashley Lunningham has more on this app and how it helps Maumel meet the needs of its citizens. She's live in our newsroom tonight. Ashley. Yeah, Chris, it's an app called C-Click Fix, a simple to use tool that the city's had for a few years now. They say it's helped keep issues in the forefront of their priorities and a line of transparency between the residents and the city. Potholes, speeding, light outages. All of these non-emergency issues can be reported straight to the city of Maumelle using the C-Click Fix app. They can do it anonymously. They can have their name there. They don't even have to create a guest account. From there, that comes to us, gets routed to the proper department, and provides a tracking mechanism where we can ensure that those requests are being responded to and sort of managed uh, ultimately. Mamel Mayor Caleb Norris says it sends in those complaints straight to the right people in the city, allowing them to organize them based on priority and able to set a due date. A dead tree will originally go to Public Works Department, who will then go out and assess whether that tree needs to come down. Maybe it's a tree that's already fallen. Uh, and uh, that due date is what then sends reminders up to the supervisor all the way up to my office if we aren't responding in a timely enough manner. The way to use it, choose what the request is about, enter the location and provide a photo and description of the problem. From there, it will be sent straight to the city. The Mayor Norris says this is a simple way for all citizens to know where to report and keeps the issues from falling through the cracks. But it doesn't magically solve or fix whatever those issues are. So we still have to find the time, the resources, and get out there. Uh, but it does prevent requests from disappearing. They don't just disappear. Currently, two other cities in the state use this app, Pine Bluff and Fayetteville. He says for a smaller city, it works well to give residents a better quality of life. A smaller city or your mid-side cities in Arkansas are just going to get swamped with the feature. So it's very basic. It can be expanded. I think the value is uh, great. It's a great value. Uh, and so I'd recommend it to other cities. Well, in the app, Norris says city officials are also able to communicate with each other on each complaint to determine when they can be fixed and how long the issue might take to remedy. On your side, I'm Ashley Lunningham. Okay, Ashley, thanks so much for that. You can find more information about that app on our website. The address is katv.com.